how to get your game looking like this to looking like this instead. With only a few easy steps which will greatly boost your FPS step 1. Create a restore point. Before making any changes, it's always a good idea to create a system restore point to ensure that you can revert to your previous settings if anything goes wrong. To do this, to create a restore point in Windows, start by pressing Windows plus S to open the search bar. Then type create a restore point and select the matching result. In the system properties window, navigate to the system protection tab and under protection settings, ensure that system protection is enabled for your system drive, usually C. If it is turned off, select the drive, click configure, choose turn on system protection and press. OK. Next, click the create button. Enter a descriptive name for the restore point such as before installing drivers and click create again. Windows will then generate the restore point, which may take a few minutes. And once completed, a confirmation message will appear stating that the restore point was created successfully. Click close, then OK to finalize the process and your system restore point is now saved, allowing you to revert your PC. Step 2. Download NVIDIA Profile. Inspector and optimize Fortnite to increase FPS and reduce lag and delay in Fortnite. Let's download and use NVIDIA Profile. Download NVIDIA Profile Inspector from the link in the description. Extract the downloaded file and open NVIDIA Profile Inspector at the sweat first. Open NVIDIA Profile Inspector and search for Fortnite to see a bunch of options. To ensure the best FPS and zero delay, I uninstalled and reinstalled the program and referenced my saved settings. Looking at my second monitor, under Second, RP Sin, and Refresh. Find G Sync Application Mode and make sure it is set correctly. If you haven't selected Fortnite, it won't work. For Yeet in full screen only, turn it off and for the settings below it, set them to Force Off. Ensure that the default option is also set to off for full screen only. Next, scroll down to maximum pre-rendered frames and set it to auto to, then set highest available for the next option under vertical sync me change. Force off to use the 3D application setting. While the settings below it should remain at default and standard. Moving further down, locate anisotropic filtering gamma correction and set it to off for sashim anisotropic filtering transparency. Super sampling, set it to nocax or replay mode. Now go to texture filtering, which is one of the most important sections. Find texture filtering LOD bias and set it to 0.75. Then for texture filtering quality, select high performance instead of high quality or performance to maximize FPS gains. Finally, under power management mode, ensure it is set to prefer maximum performance, just like the default setting. Once all these settings are adjusted, click apply changes. You can even click it multiple times to ensure it's saved. If you ever need to revert the settings, simply click the NVIDIA logo which restores everything to the NVIDIA default profile. Step 3. Download and use GearUp Booster for zero ping knee. First download the GearUp Booster tool from the official website using the link in the description and install it on your PC. And once installed, open the tool and log in using your Facebook or Google account. And on the Home tab, you'll see a list of all the games installed on your PC. While the Games tab allows you to browse thousands of games available for optimization and to boost your network performance and FPS, return to the Home tab, select the game you want to optimize, let's say Fortnite, and click the Boost button, and the tool will automatically start optimizing your game by finding the best server for you. And next, choose your server region by selecting the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the Middle East server works best and after. Selecting the server, close the window and go to the end tab, where you'll see a list of available servers in your selected region, and you can either manually pick the nearest one, or let GearUp automatically choose the best option for you, and I recommend keeping it on automatic for the best results. And finally, close the window and launch your game using GearUp Booster, which will help reduce ping, increase FPS, and provide a smoother gaming experience in Fortnite or any other game. Step 4. Disable Fortnite. Full screen. Optimization. 
Disabling full screen optimization can reduce input lag and improve FPS. To disable full screen optimization for Fortnite, start by pressing Windows plus E to open File Explorer and navigate to the installation folder, usually located at G, Shop Program, Files Epic Games, Shop Fortnite, Fortnite, Gamer Binaries, Win64, and inside the Win64 folder. Locate the file named Fortnite Client Win64 Shipping.exe. Then right click on it and select Properties. And in the Properties window, go to the Compatibility tab and check the box next to Disable Full Screen Optimizations and click Apply. Then OK to save the changes. Launch Fortnite and enjoy a smoother experience, and that's it. By following these steps, you should see a huge improvement in Fortnite's FPS, reduced input delay, and lower ping. If this video helped you, Make sure to drop a like, subscribe, and comment below if you have any questions. Check the description for all the download links. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Happy gaming!